This is the evolution of the Mercedes-Benz E-Class, one of the most popular and prestigious executive car range produced by the German manufacturer Mercedes-Benz. The E-Class has proven to be a symbol of elegance and quality. So, keep your eyes on the screen and get ready to know its evolution. The first-generation Mercedes-Benz E-Class is known under the code W124 and was produced between 1984 and 1997. It was a revolutionary model for Mercedes-Benz because it introduced new technologies such as fuel injection, multi-link suspension and airbags. As a result, it was one of the most successful cars in the Mercedes-Benz portfolio with over 2.7 million units produced in this generation. In 1993, the facelift model was introduced, which came with improvements to the exterior as well as the interior. With the second generation, the Mercedes-Benz completely changed the design of the car. They gave up the rectangular shapes and introduced curved shapes with broad lines and oval headlines. The interior was built of curved panels and had a simple and robust appearance. Under the hood, Mercedes installed gasoline or diesel units with four, six, or eight cylinders and powers between 95 and 345 horsepower. In 1999, the E-Class W210 received a facelift, and with this model, the demand began to increase. Visual improvements including a new grille, improved lights, and an updated interior with new technologies. Under the hood, the engines also have been improved to meet Euro 5 emission standards. The third-generation E-Class was launched in 2002 and follows the same design line as the previous generation, with changes to the front part but also to the completely new rear part. The interior has been updated with more modern, elegant elements and premium equipment such as air conditioning with two standard zones. Under the hood, Mercedes installed a wide range of gasoline and diesel engines and the most significant equipment was an available adaptive air suspension borrowed from the S-Class. The E-Class W211 was updated in 2006 with a new exterior look and improvements under the hood. The next generation of the E-Class was introduced in 2009 with a completely new design. The new square and very sharp double headlights together with the sharp horizontal lines gave the new W212 an aggressive and elegant look at the same time. The back was also redesigned and presented a muscular shape. The interior represented a real evolution represented by the dashboard and the double instrument cluster that housed the infotainment unit. In 2013, a facelift followed that completely changed the game. You could say that it is a new generation considering the changes made. The headlights were united, tilted towards the back and the grille, hood and back were restyled. The whole appearance of the car being curved. Inside, everything has been changed, accessorized with chrome elements and a new dashboard that presents a new infotainment system. Regarding the engine, this model also made available the hybrid version in 2013, the 300 Bluetech Hybrid with 231 horsepower. The W213 was the fifth generation of the E-Class launched in 2016. This time, it had more fluid and harmonious design than its predecessor, giving a dynamic look to the car. From the back, the car looks very good, and from the side, the straight aspect of the front was evident. The interior looks spectacular and makes the lead to a fully digital experience thanks to the two 12.3-inch screens. In 2020, the facelift model was introduced, which received new headlights, a completely new grille, and new longer taillights. The interior is also changed, the biggest change being the screen that connects the instrument cluster with the infotainment unit. The W214 is the sixth generation of the E-Class and was launched in 2023. It has a more dynamic and futuristic design than its predecessor and offers more customization and comfort options. It is the first car in the world to feature the MBUX hyperscreen system, which consists of a 56-inch curved screen that spans the entire width of the dashboard and provides an intelligent and intuitive interface for the driver and passengers. It is available only as sedan and station wagon, with a varied range of hybrid, mild hybrid or plug-in hybrid engines. 
Therefore, the Mercedes-Benz E-Class is one of the most representative and appreciated executive cars in the world, which has evolved from a simple and robust sedan to a sophisticated and technological car. What do you think about how the iconic Mercedes-Benz E-Class has evolved? 